Alright, so we're going to do another video. Hopefully it's a quick one. I just wanted to do a little how-to making this little guy here. Made that for my loading dock. It seemed like there's a few people who are asking some questions about it, so I'm going to kind of show what I did and then kind of a list of the, the materials, what I used. It only took me probably, I don't know, three hours. So it's pretty quick. So let's get into it. Alright, so what I did first, pulled up this picture that I have. The actual thing. And I took for the front. I used two by tens. I got a bunch of these and I use these for the posts. Just cut them to length. They measure eh, it's almost an inch and a half. I just I didn't really measure it too much. I just kinda used the picture and guessed with what I was using. So for most of it I use this. Let's see if I have the number here. Forty seven oh five. And I was able to use that for this one. This one, the center one, I cut other things off of it. And then I used another meter unit for the bottom one and cut the meter off of it. I painted them before I glued them. But I used flat gold gray. flat light gray, some reefer white, some gun metal, and some primer. Kind of get all my different colors. For the one on the top here, I ended up taking two pieces of that, gluing it together sanded it down and made my box. And then for the outlets on the bottom, I cut two little pieces of that to go down there. It'll zoom. Got her another light. I have all the pictures on here. But I painted that gray and then I put four little white dots for the outlets on there. So then for the conduit, this one, and the two that go across, use some 15 thousandths wire here. And just used a silver sharpie. And I also did that for the handles or latches here and you can see the other two, which when I put the pictures on, will be clearer. And then, for the extension cord, I used some, some thread, some color 236. Kind of like a dark, I don't know, kind of like a gray-blue color. And then, oh yeah, I made a little hook for it too that's yellow. And then I just sprayed it with dull coat when I was done, and it kind of made the extension cord look a little more weathered. So, yeah, I'll put some pictures up, some close-ups, 
and yeah, hopefully, oh yeah, I did, I put some decals on here too. I had some leftover locomotive warning decals, which they're that small you can't read them, you don't know what they are anyway. So, hopefully it helps. Good luck.